Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today we're unboxing the June BoxyCharm and Ipsy subscription boxes. So this is another battle to see who is the best subscription box this month. So first I'm going to go into the Ipsy bag. The first thing I got is this Pacifica Tomboy Vibe palette. And I love this palette because it includes a lot of earthy and green tone. Oop, dropped a brush. <laughs> but it's okay. <laughs> um, these shades are actually perfect for the fall. It has a lot of warm tones and green olive tones that would be great in combination together to create a earthy type of smoky eye. And these are really pigmented too. I'm going to do a quick swatch for you here. These are super pigmented. I haven't had a lot of experience with Pacifica eyeshadows in the past, but now seeing how pigmented these eyeshadows are, I'm tempted to go to Target <laughs> and pick up a couple more of these palettes. And they're really portable too, so I'm glad to include that. Um, next thing that we got is the Bare Minerals Skin Longevity Vital Power Infusion. Uh, seems to be some type of cell renewal moisturizer. And it's a nice sample size. It has a pump, which is great. And it's a decent amount of product that they included here for you to be able to sample and see if it's something that you know won't irritate your skin. Let's just try this out really quick. It has a light scent, but it's not offensive in any way. It's very watery as far as moisturizers go. So it's very, very light. I'm excited to use this, but I'm always looking for a new moisturizer because I have very dry skin. So I'm excited to use this and see if it actually works for my skin. Sorry, that's me throwing it <laughs> after a dose. We should, you should not do. <laughs> um, next thing I got is this Finding Fernand, Fernand lipstick. It's a little sample size lipstick. I never heard of this brand, Finding for a Nan, but it's cute. Oh, that's a seal. Jeez. <laughs> Should have taken this off before. Yeah. <laughs> Let's see. Oh, okay, it just pops off. <laughs> this is a beautiful berry purple pink tone. This is actually really, really pretty. It's something that I would actually wear because I love bold lipsticks. Yeah, that's a beautiful pink purple berry color. I'm very excited to have it. And I love these little travel size or sample size lipsticks because they're great for throwing in your purse and not take up too much room. So that's great to have. I also got a Ofra blush. Um, it's some type of corally red color. I'll include a picture here. Um, I'm sorry, I don't know where I put it. <laughs> I just cannot find it. But I can tell you that when I swatched it yesterday on my hand, it was very pigmented. And it's such a bold color. It's a very like deep coral color that you need to have a white hand with your blush brush when you apply it. Because it can go to clown face very quickly. <laughs> so, uh, But I'm definitely excited to have it because I don't have any Ofra blushes. I have had their highlights before and their eyeshadow, I'm oh, sorry, not eyeshadow, their lip, liquid lipsticks and their um, highlighters, but I never tried their blushes and they are very, very pigmented, which you think would be a good thing, but for as blushes go, I would prefer them to be a little bit less pigmented because like I said, you, you can really go straight to clown face with them and it just, there, there is such a thing as too pigmented of a blush, which is not a good thing. <laughs> And the last thing I got, I got these masks. I got a Natural Tox Apple Sheet Mask, which is awesome. I mean, who doesn't like sheet masks? Great for in-home spa day. And I also got a Natural Akai Berry, Akai Berry Matte Sheet. So these seem to be Korean sheet masks which is great because Korean skincare products are really on trend right now and they have in really incredible ingredients. So I'm excited to use those. 
And that's all I got in my Ipsy bag this month. Now let's move on to Boxy Charm. Here's the Boxy Charm. And the first thing that I got is actually these lashes by Banting, Ban Banting Lashes. And they're not in the box because I'm actually wearing them right now. This 4th of July makeup look is coming up in a couple of weeks, so stay tuned for that. <laughs> but I actually used them for my look, and they're really great. They're very natural looking, and they're, they're not just, they're not too bold, you know, because I like lashes that look a little bit more on the natural side, because when they're too bold and too big, they just cover up the eye makeup that I have on. And I never like doing that because, you know, what's the point of putting so much work into your eye makeup and then have this big lash just cover everything up, right? <laughs> so these are great lashes. I actually really enjoy them. The next thing that we got are these Luxie brushes. I've gotten Luxie brushes before in other subscription boxes. Um, so I know that they're great quality. I have quite a few of these Luxie brushes at this point. And we got a dual fiber dual fiber uh, brush which is great for applying blush so it will diffuse the color a lot better because it is dual fiber we also got a precision foundation brush which is like one of those typical flat uh, foundation brushes I don't like using these that much but because this one has a tapered end and it's not as flat as other ones I actually might actually use this so I'm gonna try this out and see how I like it and the last brush we got is the tapered highlighter brush. And I love getting highlighter brush because highlighter is like the best part of the whole makeup routine. <laughs> so I love getting highlighter brushes. And this looks like it's gonna be perfect. It settles right in your high cheekbones right there. So this is gonna be great. Excited for those. Next product I got here is the Jaunt, Jaunt Blue. And it seems to be an eyeliner pencil in the color 912 charcoal so it's not black it's like a dark slate gray almost I'm gonna do a little swatch here for you to see it's definitely like a smoky gray color as you can see it's very creamy I feel like this is gonna be great for smudging in, in your bottom lash line for creating a nice smudgy wing on top I'm excited to have that. I actually wanted to try experimenting with more gray liners. I used to be into that back in the day. <laughs> so I'm excited to get, have one now. The next thing I got is this Girlactic Beauty Matte Lip Paint. And this is in the color Blossom. And this color seems to be right up my alley. It's a nice, almost like a deep pink berry color. absolutely beautiful. I've had Girlactic liquid lipstick before and they are great. They're not too drying. Um, they are very pigmented and they're long lasting as well. So I'm very excited to have this. The next thing we got is this ooh, Sol Genera Fat Absorbing Body Cream. Well isn't that interesting? It actually works. I might slatter this all over myself. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh, this cream smells amazing. It smells like beach in a can or bottle. <laughs> it smells so good. It smells like coconut, pineapple, like a pina colada. <laughs> this smells amazing. I'm very excited to have this. I don't know about their fab absorbing properties though, because I feel like those things are kind of gimmicky, but this would be a great overall body cream, moisturizer. It's very creamy, doesn't seem too oily at all, and absorbs really fast in the skin. So I'm excited, oh, got some on my nose. <laughs> I'm very excited to have this. Oh, it smells amazing. Oh my goodness. My fiance is gonna love that. <laughs> Smells so good. And the last thing that we got in our box, right here, is this 
eyeshadow palette from the brand. Oh, let's see if I want which it is. Oh, uh, it is. Wait. It's the palette. Well, the palette is called Reina de Caribe Eyeshadow Palette Volume 1. And it's from the brand Al Almer Cosmetic. Almer? Which I've never heard of before. So that's interesting. I always like trying new products. These are the eyeshadows, and it's perfect for summer. Look how beautiful those are. Wow, jewel tone, gold tone that are perfect, perperfect for summer. So I'm just gonna do a quick little swatch here of these. Oh, these are so buttery and very pigmented. I mean, I'm barely touching them, and they're so, I mean, look at that. They're so pigmented. All right, I'm running out of space here to swatch, but let me do a quick little swatch over here. Oh my goodness. I think I might do a tutorial if you guys want. I can definitely do a tutorial with this palette because these colors are amazing. Let's box up. Let's look at that. Isn't that beautiful? That's so really pretty. And they're so pigmented. Look at that gold. Like I, I love the look of gold and teal together. I might do a look at those. That'd be great. And it even has warm. Uh, tones here, which I love because I love these orangey warm tones. These are so cool. Okay, let me see where I can swatch them so you can see them. Oh my goodness, these are so pigmented. Now I'm going to check this brand out a little bit more because these are great eyeshadows. Look at that. Very, very pigmented. So that's all I got in a boxy charm this month. And overall, uh, I think that both the Ipsy bag and the boxy charm were a great hit. I don't see any products in here that I wouldn't want to try. And I will put all of the prices of each product down below. And I'll also give you a total amount what each value or the about total value of each uh, box and bag so you can see if it's worth your money. And I'll see you next time. Bye.